Thanks, man. No worries. Hard day at work, eh? Yeah. All right, Toby. This is your last one. Wait, wait, Bailey. Is that the doctor that uh, found that cure for that disease? Yeah, yeah, in the mania. He's pretty huge at the moment, isn't he? Well, what aren't you doing talking to him about it? Give it a rest, Kobe. Hello, <sighs> mate. Go on, then. Mr. Larkin, I've seen you on telly. Yes, you probably have. People are saying you're a pioneer of this curing this disease. How many lives do you reckon you've saved? Hundreds? Thousands? Kobe. Served you and didn't try and get some knowledge out of you. Yeah, sure. What's, it, what's your name? Bailey, and you? Archie, Archie Larkin. Archie, nice to meet you. Archie, what, what actually inspired you to get into all this? Did you always want to do medicine or what? Mr. Larkin? Archie? I've dedicated my life to this disease, Archie. I've spent my life dedicated to this disease, Archie. I've seen many people die from it, and I've managed to save some, even though I'm not a doctor. I just know how to help people in need, particularly in this part of the country. The disease just runs with poor living conditions and low socioeconomic levels. Do you know how many people have died from pneumonia, Archie? No. Eight. While we're having this conversation, eight people have died of pneumonia. How do they treat it? Well, given my situation, there's not a lot I can do, or poor resources and all. But ideally, you'd admit them to hospital. But given as by the time I get to mo most of my patients, they can hardly speak, that's out of the question. What do you do? I keep them hydrated, and I give them pain relief. And then what do you do? Then I hope. I hope they make it through the night, and if they're in a lot of pain, I hope that they don't. Look, I'm old. I can't do the things I used to do. You know that, Archie. Yes, sir. I need a favour. I need you to take me somewhere. Where? I need you to drive me to a patient. Look, my eyes are given up on me and I, I can't drive places. Your grandmother's out of town and you're the only one that I've got. Look, sorry, Grandad, I Look, just don't... Look, Archie, this disease has been around for over a hundred years and it's not going away. This person means something to me. She's an old friend and I need you to take me. All right. Just up here, Archie. Jesse! Mr. Larkin, my mum's really sick. Come on. Don't worry, Jesse, I'll take a look at her.
track only 200 meters from here and I put my foot down a snake hole. Yari was down at the river fishing, she heard me scream. She came running up, dragged me up to this old house, put me in that bed that she's in now and tied a rope around my leg pretty tight so the poison wouldn't spread and rang an ambulance. She saved my life and I'm afraid that I'm not going to be able to do the same for her. Was there anything that really inspired you to pursue this field? Was there anything that really pushed you? 